find a scene like this in nearly every village, town, and city throughout the country. For in the hopes and dreams of everyone, there's a home they can call their own. Home brings a sense of security to a man. And to every woman, her home means a setting for gracious living. How do I know? Well, I'm a contractor. And over the years, I've helped a lot of people realize their dreams. Building new houses and remodeling old ones, too. And probably the most important step is the one these young people are going through right now. And we'll have the living room right in here. And the kitchen right here so we can see the children playing in the yard. Yeah, the children at... Children? Say, how many are you planning on? Not more than six, I hope. Uh, maybe I better add a few more rooms back here at that. Silly. And we have shrubbery, of course, right along in here. And, oh, darling, it's going to be just perfect. <laughs> That's right. It's the planning that makes all the difference between happiness and headaches as the years go by. For instance, have you two decided what material to use on the outside walls? Wood provides a number of possibilities. Or you might choose stucco. Or brick. Or stone. All of these materials have been adapted for sidewall use for hundreds of years. But suppose we look at a material designed especially for sidewalls. You know, industrial research has given us a lot of materials designed to do a specific job better and made to plan specifications. For instance, rayon and then nylon. Materials which make fabrics more beautiful and easier to care for than natural ones. And new plastic materials like this are light, strong and durable. Industry, too, has created new materials for the home. Today's floors, for example, are made of a modern, resilient material, which is more colorful, more durable, and easier to clean. And science also created asbestos cement roofing, which has made buildings safer and more durable. This material, available in many types and colors, is not only attractive, but fireproof, too. This same kind of scientific thinking was applied to the problem of sidewalls for the homes of America. In the development of a better siding material, rigid specifications were set up. It must be attractive, easy to handle, adjustable to architectural design, weatherproof, and rotproof. Furthermore, it must be safe from the hazards of fire, and above all, free from constant maintenance expense. It was natural that the scientists would turn to asbestos, for this is a remarkable mineral. Actually stone, it is made up of tiny but extremely strong and flexible fibers. Combined with Portland cement, these fibers act as a reinforcing agent, just as steel rods are used to reinforce concrete. Being stone, asbestos will not burn. In fact, it is best known for its use in all fields of fire protection. And to the great success of asbestos, combined with Portland cement in the roofing field, made it a natural choice in research for a better siding. So from long testing and experiment, there came asbestos cement siding. Strong and tough, it could be handled and applied like ordinary shingles. It was given every conceivable test. It was absolutely fire safe, for even a torch couldn't burn it. And water couldn't harm it. It withstood all kinds of weather, sun, wind, snow, and sleet. This machine called a weatherometer in a few days duplicates years of weather conditions. This material won't rot or decay, so it doesn't need paint to preserve it. However, it can be painted if the homeowner desires. Laboratory tests are only half of the story. The actual use of this material on homes over the years is the final convincing proof. 
Here is an asbestos siding shingle nearly 15 years old. And here is a brand new one. As you can see, the old shingle is still attractive, still as strong and sturdy as the day it was made. In fact, it is actually denser and harder. And so asbestos cement took its place with other sidewall materials, wood, brick, stucco, and stone. And because this material was created specifically for the job of home building, it not only combines the advantages of the other materials, but makes possible important economies in building and maintenance costs. From the standpoint of appearance, this type of sidewall creates new and pleasing effects. But its use is not confined to new construction. Here, it is being applied to an old home, right over the existing sidewalls, under the critical eye of an applicating contractor, a specialist in modernization. These applicating contractors, using great talent and imagination, are turning old houses, often eyesores, into beautiful and gracious homes. These sidewalls have no limitation as to style, size, or geographical location. For example, this is the Woodbury Gardens development in Long Island, where wide use of asbestos cement shingles is made. And here in the Southern Homes development, these colorful sidewalls add beauty to the community. This contemporary home shows how modern asbestos materials can be adapted to any style or design. Notice how the asbestos cement sidewalls help add dignity and charm. And this is the Bissell Hills development in St. Louis. Here in the heart of the Midwest, amid the rolling foothills of the Ozarks, house siding is subject to extremes of heat and cold. And here in Glasgow Village, neither high humidity nor winter ice affect walls covered with asbestos cement siding. Now let's move to California. This is the El Dorado Ranchos development in Southern California. These homes reflect the colorful West Coast trend. Asbestos cement sidewalls are ideal here, for they come in many colors that are rich in tone, colors that will stay beautiful for a lifetime. And while these walls will never need protective painting, they can be painted if the owner should ever desire a new color scheme. And so it is, from New York to Los Angeles, from Miami to Seattle, in every climate, in every community, this new sidewall has brought better homes. To get a better idea of what people in the building business think of asbestos cement sidewalls, let's visit Mr. Randolph Evans a nationally known architect. Mr. Evans, what do you think of asbestos cement siding as a sidewall for the homes you design? I like it very much. We've been waiting for it a long time. Finally, modern research has come up with a color and a texture that is just as modern and as contemporary as the houses that we're trying to do. See, in this house, I've combined it with vertical siding to get a balance. And here, on this smaller house, the horizontal lines are used to emphasize the width of the house. <clears throat> this is a very popular type of ranch house. No other material will look as well on this type of house as asbestos cement siding. This is definitely a contribution to the homeowner. It's durable, it's attractive, and it's low in maintenance cost. Well, thank you, Mr. Evans. And now let's go to Levittown, a modern garden community in Long Island, New York, a community designed for modern living. And here we find another authority, Mr. Norman Denny, Vice President for Materials of Levitt and Sons, builders of Levittown. Mr. Denny, we see that you're using asbestos cement siding on your homes. Can you tell us why? Yes. These sidewalls help us create distinctive and attractive homes. Our customers like them. We've sold more than 17,000 homes here in Levittown. And in this business, a very important point is to figure your cost right down to the bone. This type sidewall is not only good, it's economical too. And more important, it helps us keep on schedule. It has a long life 
and a low cost of maintenance. And first, last, and always, our customers like them. And what they like, we like. Thank you, Mr. Denny. And now let's talk to still another person. This is Mrs. Adams. Well, Mrs. Adams, we've been admiring your new home. Well, it's not so new. In fact, it's, it's over 30 years old. However, we did have new sidewalls put on about 10 years ago. But tell us, Mrs. Adams, what has been your experience with these asbestos cement sidewalls? Well, we've been very pleased. Joe, that's my husband, got an FHA loan to have the job done. He figures that what we've saved by not having to paint the walls every few years has more than paid for the new siding. And it certainly has improved the value of the place. Though we're not thinking of selling, mind you. And, well, I like the looks of it. And it's never given us any trouble at all. And so it is all over the country. For business buildings, and apartments, for farm homes and buildings, for churches, for remodeling, for big houses and cottages. The people who use asbestos cement siding report with satisfaction. It keeps homes snug and tight against all kinds of weather. It gives real protection against the hazards of fire. For example, here is a home protected with asbestos cement sidewalls that withstood the intense heat of this brush fire and escaped unharmed. And so we suggest you consider this material for the walls of your home. Designed to last a lifetime, a trouble-free lifetime. Oh, it is attractive. Yes, and it'll stay that way, too. That's what I like about it. Yes, and that goes for all who plan to build a new home or modernize an old one. For here, like your modern plastics, like your asbestos roof, like your modern floor covering, is a material made according to plan, a product developed to meet your needs and designed for a lifetime of beauty. Company was the first to make asbestos cement shingles for use exclusively on sidewalls. These homes built with ruberoid sidewalls are all over 12 years old. You'll notice that they're still fresh and attractive, and incidentally, they're all white. Today's home builders, however, are color conscious. With new production methods and techniques, with a new concept of color and style, Asbestos cement sidewalls have become an important element in exterior home design. And here is the newest and most exciting development in the entire siding field. Ruberoid's amazing new color-grained sidewalls. Notice the richness, the warmth, the charm of these sidewalls. Notice too the exclusive duotone colors. These were decorator designed for Ruberoid by one of the nation's leading color consultants. These distinctive grain textured dual tone shades bring modern color styling within the reach of everyone. The selection of rich colors enables anyone to be his own exterior decorator, makes possible effects found only in the most expensive homes. Note these colors produced by an exclusive new process. This is the distinctive moss green. Notice the natural appearing texture, so closely resembling wood shakes. And here is a rustic brown color grain shingle. See how the textured finish adds richness and depth to the shingle. This is birch gray. The darker tone in the valleys of the texture gives the duo tone shading, which makes this siding outstanding. And this is the mission ivory shade, so perfect for modern ranch house styles. Notice how the straight grain finish with its highlight and shadow effect makes vertical joints invisible. 
Yes, these distinctive grain textured duotone shades bring modern color styling within the reach of everyone. Yet the charm and beauty of these sidewalls are achieved by more than the color and texture that is built into these shingles. It comes in part from this striking shadow line which adds so much to the appearance. This too is an exclusive patented ruberoid feature. To get this effect, the applicator first installs the specially designed asphalt shadow edge weather strips. They provide a tight weatherproofing seal for the wall. A felt backing is not needed. Now, when the siding is nailed in place, the lower edge of each shingle is raised about a quarter of an inch. This produces a heavy shadow line, similar to those found with clapboard or double coarse wood shingles. The same effect can be gained by using a tapered wood strip or wood lath. Felt backing, of course, is used in this case. These wood strips provide an ideal nailing base for applying asbestos siding over non-wood sheathing without the use of special fasteners. Note the pleasing effect. The combination duotone shingles and the distinctive shadow edge method of application bring a new concept of beauty to today's homes. And of course, because they're made of asbestos cement, they're practically indestructible. And here's another ruberoid asbestos cement product. This soffit is stonewall board, made for lifetime use. With new colors, new styling, new textured shingles, you too can be an exterior decorator. Whether you wish to bring new beauty to old side walls or to create a truly modern, beautiful new home, be sure to look at Ruberoid Color Grain Siding, the decorator design siding which will keep your home bright, clean, and new for years to come. Mm -hmm.